What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Zach, if it's your first time dropping in. And uh, happy holidays to you. Getting ready for 2024. And we need to talk about Cardano as it relates to 2024. Ada, one of my top holdings, guys. And I feel better about holding Cardano than just about every other major altcoin. There are a few that I feel really, really strong about, right? And Cardano is certainly one of those few. My top altcoins outside of Bitcoin and Ethereum, if you guys aren't aware, it's Cardano, Caspa, and Polygon. Those three, to me, are the three cryptos that I sleep well at night knowing that they're stored, they're locked away, they're long-term investments, and I don't have to worry about them rug pulling or anything crazy. When it comes to Cardano, though, there's something special about ADA. Not only its community, because that is just amazing in and of itself, and it's so important to have a strong community in crypto, but it's also about they're just doing things different. And we've had a number of major upgrades take place here throughout the bear market. We're finally seeing Cardano reap the rewards from a price standpoint. If you guys remember, we were sitting at 25 cents, the basement there for a while. Finally, we popped back over that, got into uh, some nice territory here, and we're trying to make some new local highs actually this year with the potential to do so as Cardano right now sitting at uh, 63 cents, give or take. But in this video, I wanted to talk about some of the major upgrades, more upgrades coming in 2024, and also highlight uh, some of the things I'm looking forward to in 2024 as a whole in the overall market and how Cardano fits into all of that. So if that's something that interests you guys, definitely smash the like button, subscribe down below, and I appreciate you guys as always for coming back here to the channel. And uh, again, if you're new, welcome in. And I'm gonna take you over here on the other side of the desk and uh, we'll talk about why I love Cardano, guys. And uh, what has got me so excited about ADA. All right, so if we uh, take a look at what's happening right now, we've had a lot of hard forks, some just big updates take place. Cardano's uh, Chang hard fork will take place early in 2024. Uh, so this is another major upgrade like we've seen in the past, guys. Uh, and uh, Cardano's core organization, Emergo, has outlined its plans in 2024, focusing on the upcoming Chang hard fork scheduled for the first half of 2024. So this major network event marks the transition to a community-driven governance model. We talked about how strong community is in Cardano at the top of the video. This is going to strengthen the community even more, giving them more say-so, more power over what happens in their ecosystem. This is marking Cardano's commitment to decentralized decision-making in the blockchain space. So not only is it one of the top Ethereum competitors, one of the top 10 cryptos, but it is arguably the most decentralized outside of Bitcoin, in my opinion. Now, the Chang hard fork is key is a key aspect uh, of the strategic roadmap designed to kickstart the bootstrapping period of Cardano's governance model. Unlike traditional governance structures, a hard fork introduces a consensus mechanism, a consensus mechanism that allows ADA holders to actively shape the trajectory of the network as a whole. So according to Charles Hoskinson, the creator of uh, the blockchain itself, Cardano, she showed that, uh, basically said Cardano showed everyone how to properly stake, and now it will show everyone how to properly implement decentralized governance. The transition to the Voltaire era, outlined in proposal CIP 1964, demonstrated Cardano's commitment to achieving full community governance in 2024. We'll, do, we'll, do, we'll demonstrate that, including workshops, conferences, and voting. Now, beyond governance, there's more. Cardano's 2024 roadmap includes plans to expand tokenization. This is an area I'm super excited about. The tokenization of real-world assets has been talked about by the world profound leaders, right? Larry Fink of BlackRock has talked about it. Pretty much everybody now is talking about the tokenization of real-world assets, RWA. And this could provide fertile ground for decentralized applications built on top of Cardano in the DeFi and NFT world. Notably, Cardano's unique approach allows tokens to be issued without the need of smart contracts. 
making it easier for brands and creators to enter the Web3 space without the hiccups. In addition, Cardano aims to support the development of third-party dApps as well and improve their interoperability or the ability to communicate, blockchain's uh, ability to communicate with other blockchains, strengthening its commitment to collaborative innovation. So while Cardano has had some amazing years here, even throughout the bear market, I'm most excited about their 2024 and this next bull run. Because if we just look at the cycles in general, right, what we're expecting to see here as it relates to crypto, we know that Bitcoin was first, right? Ethereum had its run this last previous cycle. Next up are what? The competitors to Ethereum, some of the other major smart contract players. And Cardano is right there. And I think Cardano has been undervalued, underappreciated for a long time now, and it's been around since 2017. It's went through some cycles. It's Cardano's time. And there's a reason why Coin Bureau put out there recently that Cardano could literally go to $20 to $25 in this next cycle, because he believes this as well. Now, that's a crazy upside target, but even if we cut that in half and say $12 to $15, that is still immense upside for a crypto right now, around 20x gains for a crypto that's in the top 10. That's how big Cardano could get. And I'm betting big on them. You got to take some chances. Of course, none of this is financial advice, guys. Okay. I am just an investor like all of you, but you guys know I've talked about Cardano for a long time. I am heavily invested, heavily believing in what Cardano and Charles Hoskinson are building. And I am super excited for this next upcoming bull run because I think it is Cardano's time along with some other major cryptos in that top 15 range. I think it's their time as well. But Cardano just feels really good in terms of its upside potential, the risk associated with it, and where we could potentially go in this next crypto bull run. I appreciate you guys as always. Don't forget to smash the like button down below. We'll see you in the next one. Peace out.